Alright guys, what's going on? Uh, so this honestly is probably the last PSP video you guys are ever going to see me make. And uh, yes, I'm making this on Christmas because I don't have anything better to do. Um, but uh, CW Cheat hasn't seen an update for a really long time. And uh, well, now it's about time that we got it to... Um, work on the uh, 6.XX custom firmwares. Now originally it was designed for 620 HEN custom firmwares, uh, but this will work with these versions as well. So uh, you can see right here that uh, on my remote joy I'm running on 660 Pro C custom firmware on my PSP Go, the 5G, and um, a little of that there. And uh, just to show PSP Go, there's there's the clock and uh, also the uh, Bluetooth device settings as well so that's all there and uh, what I'm just going to simply have you do is um, go and activate USB mode and uh, go in USB mode and bring up your PSP's uh, internal memory so you activate USB mode and uh, your remote play should come up and uh, See that in there. Exit. I got a memory stick in mine too, so that's, that's probably why it's all like, hey, what's going on? Uh, is this my memory stick? Yes, this is my memory stick. So I need to go to. Well, I'll just go to computer. Uh, I can find it. Alright, and here it is. Alright, so this is the, um, the, uh, the internal memory of my PSP Go that I'm using. So first things first, SE plugins folder, you're going to need that. And, um, if you don't have one, just, uh, right click and say new and go and say folder or whatever and create a folder SE plugins uh, all in lowercase letter letters or you can just click new folder up here and name SE plugins but open that up and now what you can do is create another new folder inside here and call it CW cheat all in uh, all in capital letters and then uh, leave it at that and then open up that folder there so now what you're going to have to do is, I'm just going to drag this over here real quick and grab these files over here so I can actually see them. And uh, first thing you're going to want is the uh, CWCheat23 underscore 620HEN uh, PRX. So that file that you download off my website, uh, it'll be there. And, uh, and it'll give a little description here on where to place it to. Uh, for uh, specific reasons and things like that. Uh, yeah. Alright. Do they want to have a lowercase or fucking capital? I don't know. I'll just... CW. I guess it doesn't really matter what it is, but I'm just going to put it in lowercase like it says in the archive anyway. So your CW cheat folder and your SE plugins folder are all lowercase letters. My mistake. And uh, in the extracted files you're going to see the CWCheat23620HEN and inside there will be the PRX. Then just drag and drop this PRX into the CWCheat folder. Once you've done that, you're going to want the database. So open up the database file, the 11.23 dot to um, whatever and uh, open that folder up and you're going to see the cheat DB and the cheat pops DB. The cheat pops DB is for PS1 emulation and the cheat DB is for selected games for PSP only. So allow that and just drag and drop those into the CW cheat folder as well. So once you've done that, you can exit this now, and we have to go back to the SE Plugins folder. <clears throat> and inside the game folder here, or not the game folder, uh, inside your SE Plugins folder, there should be a game text document. If you don't have one of those, just right click, say new, and text document, and it'll be there. So open up the game, 
and then what you're going to type on a new line uh, if you have a memory stick it's going to be MS0 like that um, but I don't have that so I'm going to be typing EF0 and colon slash and then uh, write SE plugins and then another slash and then you're going to say CWCHEAT and then slash on that and then CWCHEAT dot PRX space one and I'll have that written below in the description typed out so you don't get confused on what it is and just to double check and make sure that it's correct you can go to CW cheat right here and look at the CW cheat dot PRX and uh, it'll say CW CHEAT dot PRX and then right here you just write at the end of the code CW CHEAT dot PRX space one I don't know why there's a space one it just works better that way so exit the game text and hit save <coughs> and leave it as that so you put the cheat database and the cheat for pops database inside the CW cheat folder and the SE plugins folder on your PSP's memory stick or HDD on the PSP Go the CW cheat PRX is there your game text states that it'll be running correspondingly with EF0 colon forward slash SE plugins forward slash CW cheat forward slash CW cheat dot PRX space one and all that is saved to your either memory stick or the HDD and that's about it so if you hit exit and that now you can exit USB mode on your PSP and I'm just gonna reset the VHS uh, VSH right here um, so that I can show you on remote joy what is the next steps so drag this to the center of the screen here plug this in alright so we're here on the PSP XMB so uh, drag this a little bigger alright so as my fucking mouse falls across the fucking room uh, so what you're going to do now is I want you to hit select and I want you to go to the recovery menu. So go into the recovery menu and you're going to want to go to your plugin section. So go to your plugin sections and for PSP Go users, if you're using the system storage, the system storage is there. If you're just using a memory stick, it's there. And anything before PSP Go, it's not going to say system storage at all. It'll just go directly to your memory stick. So in this case, we use the system storage on my PSP. Uh, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to uh, go, see I have like two pages of fucking things, go to the uh, next page and you'll see cwcheat.prx for game is enabled. Make sure that that is enabled. So I'm just going to go back and back again and go back to my XMB now and let's go to a game and I don't even know what fucking game I want to do um, let's see what do I got in my memory stick here nothing good? great so I'm just gonna go into the uh, Grand Theft Auto Liberty City stories here alright so let me just get the game rolling and then I'll show you what's gonna happen next And uh, this is a backup of a game that I own, so uh, just stating that. And three, two, one. And here we are in the game. This is taking forever. Okay, so I'm just going to give up on that because for some reason the game's not running. 
and I don't want to waste any more time, but when you're inside the games, um, you're basically just going to go ahead and hit and hold select for like three seconds, and then after you hold select for three seconds, a menu will pop up, and then you'll be able to navigate through that menu to activate certain types of cheats. These files right here will be for download, and uh, if you go to like if you want to, you can go and search and see what games this database is compatible with and uh, yada yada. Uh, little known pointer, if you're using a PSP Go and you have games on your memory stick, you will have to install the CW Cheat database and the PRX on the memory stick as well. So when you go and play games off your memory stick, you can use the CW Cheat on your memory stick as well because it will not work if you have it installed on the HDD and you're trying to use it with a game that is running off the memory stick in a PSP Go. So that's that. So other than that, rate, comment, subscribe. Like I said, these files will be here for download uh, from softwarereborn.com in the PSP SE plugins section on my website. And uh, I will be doing updates on my website, and like I said, this is probably the last PSP video you're going to see me make, because I'm going to be selling my PSP Go, and I'm going to be getting a PS Vita very soon. So, uh, yeah, other than that, feel free to donate to my channel for more proceeds, more products, for more tutorials for you guys. And uh, I'll keep up to date as best as I can, because I got my new job now. So, yeah, enjoy, I hope this helps you, and I will talk to you guys as soon as I can. And, uh... Merry Christmas, too, because I'm making this video on Christmas. What do you know? All right. Enjoy the rest of your evening.